Hello, welcome to the latest in our series of podcasts sharing information with you about the University of Evansville. I'm Tom Kazee, president of the university. Thanks to all who attended our inauguration and the week of events that preceded it. It was a wonderful opportunity to share the Evansville experience with alums, with students, with parents, and with folks in the community. We also were able to dedicate the Melvin Peterson Gallery featuring the work of artist Les Miley on the Sunday following the inauguration. That was a very special moment in the life of the university. We have a slate of exciting events coming up this fall. Starting next week, our Thomas C. Fittick Memorial Lecture will be presented by Marilyn B. Young, a professor of history at New York University, who will talk on the subject of Necessary Wars of Choice, America's Limited Wars, Past and Present. That event will happen on Friday, October the 29th at 7.30 p.m. in ICAMP Hall. Also, Sharon and I are very excited to take our first trip to Harlexton College this month. It's a wonderful part of the University of Evansville. Harlexton is, of course, the British campus of the U University of Evansville. We're very much looking forward to spending time with Gordon Kingsley and his wife, Suzanne. Also, I'm pleased to welcome one of the most respected names in Evansville sports to the UE family. Lance Wilkerson, who's been the sports director at News 25 for more than a decade, will be joining the University of Evansville as the director of development in athletics and our new voice of the Aces on campus radio station WUEV 91.5. Also, be sure to note that on October the 28th, we'll begin a series of community talks given by UE faculty. We look forward to sharing the expertise of our faculty with the community, and that'll be the first of a number of talks. We look forward to you joining us again for future podcasts. If you have comments, questions, or observations about these podcasts, please share those with me at president at evansville.edu. Thanks so much.